This excerpt from the public television program, The Piano Guy, is brought to you by NAM, the International Music Products Association. In this segment, we'd like to work through Neil Sedaka's famous tune, Love Will Keep Us Together. With me to work through the tune is my good buddy, Dave Powers. Hey, Scott. How are you, Dave? What's going on? Well, this is a tune, obviously, that was recorded and made very famous. I mean, Neil Sedaka did it, but then Captain and Tennille. Captain that, and Tennille. But there's a throwback to the pop era mm -hmm. of the 70s, right? Where at the uh, end of the song, they sang, Sedaka is back. Yeah, that's right. Because he, he made a comeback around 1974, 73, with yeah. Laughter in the Rain and some yeah. other songs. So Love Will Keep Us Together was just that wonderful brill-building songwriting. When I mentioned the Brill Building, it's yeah. a building in New York where Carole King and Neil Sedaka and they would write songs for artists. Oh, neat. Be before the era of singer-songwriter. Right. You know, they would say, well, I, you've got this pop star and he needs some material. Well, you know, here's the Did latest stuff cranked out. They'd crank out a couple songs a day. Neat. Maybe more than that. I don't know. And they were, they were, they were geniuses, in really. In the Brill Building. Brill Building, yeah. Never heard it. I'll have to look that up. That sounds interesting. Yeah, Neat. Carol King, Neil Sedaka, Brill Building. Look that up in the Google, you'll find it. Very interesting. Good songs were written no doubt. For, for many different artists. Love Will Keep Us Together was just one of those big tunes that put the Captain and Tennille on the map. Sure. And Now there's kind of a, you know, the, when I think of that, I instantly think and it's, it is it was a keyboard-based tune instead of a guitar-based tune. Right. And there's that boop, da, 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 there's that kind yeah. of thing, so. Right. Right. So let's go ahead and give that away if we can. Mm -hmm. That's kind yeah. of the, the start of the We're going to play the song in the key of F. Okay. It's not the original key of the song. I believe maybe it's the, it's the key that Neil Sedaka probably sings it in. Okay. Um, but the Captain and Tennille did it in B, just so you know. If you, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Now I know. I, I do know that. And, and it's just take the F chord and you go, you move your finger up. So you're kind of hanging out on the yeah, you're making the, the F, F and the A. You're taking it, and then it becomes like an F seven. Okay. And then seventh in there, and the bass. Oh, you know, I, I forgot <laughs> about that. That is That's a real a identifier. Thing. Thing. Yeah. I'll play that real slow. Okay. It's like F, B, C, E, F, A, B flat, B, C, F. E flat, D C, B C B C. Okay, now do it in tempo. Yeah. It's odd to have that syncopated. Think of the bass line that kind of breaks. Okay. So at that point, it starts kind of following this pattern of, of mm -hmm. you know, working through the chord changes, which kind of move what? From a yeah. F? Yeah. yeah. Doing that thing. I think, next, I think he borrowed this lick e from Brian Wilson when the Beach Boys did a tune called uh, Do It Again. Yeah. Their melody was like a da 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 da, da. And, and and coincidentally enough, the captain, yes. his name was Daryl Dragon. Yes. He played keyboards with the Beach Boys. Oh no kidding! For a while, yeah, yeah. I didn't know went, that. Went on went on tour as a backing musician for the Beach Boys. So All it's I that West the, Coast thing. All I remember is his hat, you know. The hat. Must have right. been nervous about his hairline or something. You never know. <laughs> <laughs> they really are great performers. Yeah, I, I saw them recently, and they they're still at it. Oh, that's great. Still married, doing a wonderful. Neat. Job. Okay, uh, yeah, let's keep pushing forward. And then E flat chord, okay, but it's so an E flat. You add that. Like a sixth. Sixth, right. Okay. But still following that same kind of accompaniment feel. Right, you still have to... that melody at the top. And then you go to a D7. D. Okay. Same thing. Okay. And then you get to good old rock and roll here, just. And I'm playing as if it was a power chord okay. for a guitar. I'm going. Okay. So you're really just playing octave, yeah, octave yeah. B flats with that F in there. Right. Okay. And I'm adding this. So at that as point, as if a guitar player was playing. Sure. So at that point, you're really just trying to, to you're kind of playing rhythm changes behind it, right? I mean, you're yeah. just, you're just do 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 yeah. do. And there's no long. 
singing a song. I mean, we haven't even got to the melody yet. Yeah, right. uh, we're just showing you how to accompany. Right. right. If you're accompanying yourself singing or accompanying somebody, you hear that as much as possible. If you're going to play the melody, well, you'd have to kind of work it Try around to mix just a little it bit. Well, you're going to be singing this one, right. so that's okay. We'll stick to the accompaniment style, because that's okay. really, that's kind of the signature of this tune from a piano standpoint, is to hear that. Da, 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 that's what everyone wants to hear in this one. It's rock and roll. Um, in the bridge, it goes, young and beautiful. Yeah. What a flat there? is the chord. Okay, A flat. And then E flat, B flat. Okay. D flat, back to F. Okay. A flat. E flat, B flat, D flat, and then a C sus, which that's is kind of like playing yeah. a. That's a G minor seventh chord with a C in the bass ah, line. It's a good way to think of it. Yeah, G yeah. minor a seven simple, over C. Yeah, it could be a, a simple way I think we can tell people too is if you just played a C major chord and took the middle note and went up a half step, you're going to be C F and G, right? That's going to suspend it. That's one way yeah, of doing it, sus, yeah. 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 Another way of making that sound really there. good is maybe playing a B flat chord over, over a C. C. Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of a slash I think that chord. sounds more like the way you know. I will, I will, I will, I will. <laughs> I will. <laughs> well, when I learned it, the, the record skipped. Yeah. The record it stuck. So it was like, I will, I will, I will. will. <laughs> that's the way it's. Uh, Perfect. Um, now, how do you approach, I guess, I'm thinking this through, this is a tune that you pretty much can't do a lot of noodling around with and putting your own arrangement on it, right? I mean, tunes like this, you're kind of locked into playing what you think the record sounded like, you think? Yeah, because there aren't a lot of gaps for noodling. Yeah. You know, unless you do, instead, you better stop, and then the record's like, oh, there's some yeah, yeah. synthesizer there. Sure. You, you better stop. Cause I really love you, stop. I'll be thinking, you could play just sure. the, the F there. But I think for, again, I'm always kind of approaching, thinking for viewers of the show saying, gosh, we're, you know, we've not tackled this mm -hmm. kind of thing before. How am I approaching this versus, you know, this versus that? In these kind of tunes and these pop tunes, you really need to be, you're, you're thinking, you're kind of being the whole rhythm section. Yes. Yeah, this is a, I'm, I'm, right. I'm the rhythm section behind so you have to, some soloist out there You have there to playing. play those, you know, yeah. rock and roll, -na 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 -na, the eighth note thing. And just, and accenting, do -do 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 -do, so you can drive that rhythm going. Okay. And I'm just okay. going, what, I'm, I'm, I'm hitting those, they're fifths, but sometimes I'm not hitting them like that, sometimes I'm hitting them like that. Sure. This may be B flat chord, but if, but I'm, I'm playing. That makes Where sense. That's on top. Yeah, you're just thinking about rhythmic stuff and you're kind of filling in the background so you can sing on top of it, right? Okay. Well, listen, let's, let's listen to you do this tune. And uh, All right. if, yeah, if I can lean on you a little bit, I'll ask you to sing this one. So no we'll, we'll pay attention to the accompaniment. We'll pay attention to that, that lick, that do, do, mm -hmm. do, do, that thing. It's going to happen throughout the whole thing. And cool. also pay attention to the bass line we learned. So. All right. I'll do my best with the lyrics, too. And if I get stuck, just chime in and sing okay. along. Okay. All right. Great, great. together think of me babe whenever some sweet talking guy comes along singing a song don't mess around you just got to be strong just stop cause I really love you stop I'll be thinking of you look in my heart and let love keep us together you, you belong to me now <laughs> Ain't gonna set you free now When those guys start hanging around Talking you down here in your heart And you won't hear a sound You just stop Cause I really love you Stop I'll be thinking of you, look in my heart and let love keep us together, whatever. Young and beautiful, someday your looks 
will be gone when the others turn you off who'll be turning you on i will i will i will i will be there to share forever love will keep us together i said it before and i say it again love is pretend i need you now and i need you then you just stop Cause I really love you, stop I'll be thinking of you Look in my heart and let love Keep us together Whatever We're young and beautiful Someday your looks will be gone When the others turn you off turning you on I will I will I will I will be there to share forever love will keep us together I said it before and I say it again love is pretend I need you now and I need you then you just stop cause I really love you stop Thinking of you, or look in my heart and let love keep us together. Something like that. Yeah, that was a good one, man. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Sure. This excerpt from the public television program, The Piano Guy, has been brought to you by NAM, who reminds you that playing a musical instrument is a fun, interactive hobby that benefits your mind, body, and spirit. It's never too early or too late to start. Want to play?